Hey guys, what's up? Um, I'm just uh, gonna make a quick video about the Anycast M2 Plus. So um, it's the cheap copy the, of the Google um, Chromecast and I got it from eBay. I uh, just wanted to tell you guys that it works really well and it does the job. Now if you're looking to stream videos uh, from your iPhone or from your MacBook then it's fine. But if you would want to use it as a Android stick, uh, well, this is not the one then. So um, what this does is it connects into your television, uh, say a Sony Bravia as like the one I have. And then you can basically uh, turn it to HDMI and um, then you can um, uh, go into AirPlay and it works perfectly fine. It's pretty much seamless and I use it all the time to stream music to stream um, photos and to stream videos now let me tell you one thing because this connects to your local Wi-Fi and your phone or your computer is connected to the Wi-Fi as well so uh, what happens is when you try to stream any video it's it's very slow uh, so uh, it's quite choppy so just keep that in mind but it still uh, does the job um, I'm very happy to buy it because it just costed me 10 pounds but um, it works really well so yeah uh, so that's the that's the box how it looks really well packaged now I'll quickly show you that where I've connected it and I've got this uh, to the HDMI and uh, that's the Wi-Fi um, dongle with it right so be, which is being powered so what we can do is basically when you basically start it up you just need to uh, press the function button and that's what uh, controls all the functions for for, uh, you, for this dongle. Um, how it really works. You want to go selection and HDMI which will appear when you connect your any cost. So it's uh, pretty much well laid out and it tells you that for the first time you need to connect your any cost to the router. So that's the IP address. So once you plug it in, right, you need to go to that IP address and then you need to configure your any cost right after you configure it then so you guys if you if you do any mistake or if you um, if you've lost any step or if it's connected and you want to reconnect it you just have to um, go over here and you just need to press this function button and it'll basically reset everything again so yeah and then you have to start again connect um, connect to your local Wi-Fi and once you give this the power and you you can you can just go to this address and then um, that will basically take you into the operating system of the dongle and from there you connect to your local address so my local address is over here so that's why it's connected already otherwise uh, this would be blank and uh, that won't be blank that's by default so after that's done it's uh, quite simple if I could show you um, from my computer right. and I have a website open so um, so that's the that's the thing which will be presented with the airplay mark over here so if I just go and I click any cost so as soon as I click any cost it will the screen flickers and as you can see my whole desktop is now on my 42 inch Bravia. So guys, thank you very much for watching my video and hope you enjoyed it and do uh, share, subscribe and like.